Hi, I'm Jenny from Designist. We are a design-led home and giftware store um, on South Great Georgia Street and we also sell online on designist.ie. We've been here since November 2010. We only decided we were going to open the store in September and um, to doing it at that pace we kind of knew we needed to be open before Christmas. So getting the premises, making sure everything worked right, getting the credit card machines and all that kind of parts of it. And it was kind of, it was, it was really funny that we had a launch party on the Thursday before we opened and then turned around and realised we actually had to have a shop after this. Like, we thought that maybe maybe all we had to do was have a party um so the realities of, of retail kind of kicked in after that um but it's a lovely business to be in my favorite part of it is definitely dealing with the customers and we have a, a, a really nice loyal customer base who are very willing to give us lots of feedback and who really enjoy the environment and that's that's really important just to kind of make somewhere that's warm and inviting and interesting and you see a lot of people walking around the shop uh, um, kind of giggling to themselves when they cotton on to the idea that behind a lot of the products because that's very definitely um, the, the products are very much about the ideas. Well we're very small, we're a small company and um, there's two of us running it and we have two other part-time staff. We meet a lot of people um, and we get to talk to people and I think that's kind of what keeps it different and interesting and fun. When we opened first of all as well, we, had, we, we used to be a kind of a date shop, which was really nice. You'd get somebody who'd already been in the shop once before and they'd bring somebody in and walk them around all the products and show them how cool everything was. It was like a way of saying, I'm into good stuff and I'm interesting and I'm not afraid of domesticity. And we actually had a playlist that we used to, to play, particularly when we noticed that there was anybody in here who was on a date. Yeah, we, it was a kind of Motown, mostly Motown playlist, but that had a lot more romantic songs on it. We do our own range of greeting cards, which we have a lot of fun with. Uh, we're coming up to Valentine's Day soon and they are my favourite cards. Um, we get to make a lot of Valentine's cards and that's, that's really good crack. The cards are a really nice part of the, the, the stuff that we do because having a card to go with a present is always an important part of it. But it's something that you can be a bit more frivolous with, that you can be a bit more irreverent with. Um, so you want the product to say that you think they're elegant or interesting or full of good ideas, but you can be a bit uh, cheekier with the card. So it is kind of bringing our own sense of humour into the into the product a little bit as well. So our best seller uh, last year was, you know, there's no one I would rather watch a box set with. So it's very much about the re uh, reality of being in a relationship rather than the, the um, sort of fantasy notions of being crazily in love with somebody. You know, that you, you have a real life with the person that you're, you're involved with. The value that we give the customer is that we've done all the research into the different products and what's a kind of a current idea. So at the minute we've got um, lecture notebooks which are being used for bullet journaling and that is so fashionable when customers started coming into us saying have you got the right notebooks for bullet journaling so we have to kind of follow that trend as well so there'd be a lot of products that have worked like that for us where you're because you're doing the research and finding out about things people can know that we'll, we will have the right thing for them i think you'll always get an original gift we put the work into finding deadly stuff and then you get to hand it to someone and get all the credit for it so uh, yeah